Hi everyone, this is again Nato from Perfecto. Earlier I've shown you how you can start your regression testing with a plain Java and TestNG. Here I'll show you some basic regression 101 with Perfecto scriptless, a no-code solution you're going to love right away. We'll be using the same scenarios so you can compare the different software and decide what's best for you. To start with Perfecto Scriptless, you need to navigate to your Perfecto portal and select Build Web Test. On the welcome page, you need to name the project, name the first test, select HTTP or HTTPS based on the website you're going to be testing, and enter the URL. Click Start Building Test and wait. In a matter of seconds, Perfecto will spin a virtual machine for your test. It will be available to you for as long as it's needed. It will navigate to the site. And it's ready. Here you can create your test with ease and efficiency. Again, we're going to check if the submenu items are visible for testing cloud, testing features, and automation frameworks. Let's see how this is done. Select platform. Select Action Click. Select Testing Cloud. Again, Action Click. And now let's see if all of the submenu items are here. Select the first. Select Check element present. Select the second. The third. And the fourth. This is it. You've done it. Let's see how the test would run. Click step over. If you want to make sure that the test was created properly, you can rerun it from here or here. After you have created your first test, it's time to go for the second one. Click Create New Test, give it the name, 
and click Add. It will navigate to the same browser location. Now, let's add the steps for the new test. Again, platform, action click, testing features, action click, and now here we see a pop-up window blocking all of our submenu items. We might want to get rid of this. Click on the X. Action click. And continue with the inspection of the elements. Click. Check element present. and so on for the rest of the sub-menu items. We are done with this test as well, so now you can simply end it and rerun it to make sure it's done properly. When you're done with all the tests creation, you can view a list of all the tests you have created. Just click Menu and Tests. Here they are, all of the tests that you have created. So now after we have them here, let's just organize them into a job. Again, Menu, Jobs, Add Job. Let's name it. and click Add. Let's add the tests. And we're done with the adding of the tests. If you want the tests to run on a schedule or at a specific time interval, here is how to do it. Click Schedule. Add schedule 
And now here you can select either by time intervals or at a specific time. Let's go for every two hours on Tuesday and let's click add. You can even get notified via email or Slack upon completion. Just click notifications, enable the toggle and select edit configurations. You need to create yourself some notification channel that you can use afterwards. Give it a name, select email or Slack. I'll go for an email, enter the email address. Click create, select from the drop down menu and save. After the job is already created and set up, it's now time to run it. Again, you can sit back and enjoy Perfecto doing the testing for you. After the job is finished, you can check the reporting as discussed in the first section of this article. Test analysis, report library. Here are all of the executions you have done recently. In one of the next training sessions, I will show you more on Perfecto Smart Analytics. This was your starting educational video on Regression 101 with Perfecto Scriptless. Thank you for participating, have a nice day and happy testing with Perfecto.